I got this hot end here with the hardened steel tip plus five extra hardened steel tips for 14 bucks. Well, almost 15 bucks, 14 something. So I thought I'd grab it and just when the machine came, I, I would replace it, see if it's ex the same because you never know what you're getting from AliExpress. It's exactly the same nozzle. Size-wise and everything. And they don't have the, the glue on here or whatever they put on here. So you're able to change the nozzles, obviously, because they gave you five extra. So I'm going to put this on and see how it goes. The way they put this cover on is a little bit weird. Um... To me, anyway. I'll show you once I get it off. Let me try to get a light in here. Like, you need to press in here. If you guys can see that. Right where the fan holes are. If you press with your hand, tighten it in. And then pull it out. That's how this cover comes off. Let me unplug the fan. And I'll show you what holds this fan in. Uh, sorry, the cover in. Let me grab the phone here. What holds it in is these tabs. these tabs right here you guys can see that one here one up here and two on the other side and it just the cover just clips into there but to take it off there's no way to push these tabs in and how can you anyway like there's four of them you can't how are you going to push four of them in at the same time? So you actually need to squeeze the cover here. You actually need to squeeze the cover here. Let me put the phone back. They clip onto here. It clips onto here. So you actually need to squeeze the cover I gotta get better lighting in this garage, but if you squeeze it here, it kind of moves this out a little bit. Like, it's just weird the way they did it. So, uh, in other words, you need to be careful because if you remove it uh, a, a lot of times, you'll end up wearing or breaking these tabs off. So anyway, that's the cover. To remove the nozzle, take the boot off, there's this lever here, push it all the way up and the nozzle will come out. And then there's a, a little, let me lower the camera down a little bit. And then in here, there's like a little hook just to hold the wires up. Just got to bring the wires over this way. There. And then the plug... It's just like an ordinary plug. There's a tab that you just have to squeeze in. And it comes out. There's like that little tab here. And you just squeeze it and pulls out. Like a regular plug. Uh, pay attention to how this is in. 
if you see the the hot end, it's a little bit off center. So this here, there's a higher part to the hot end, a high than a lower part. Just make sure the high part is facing you when you install it back. Cool? Cool. So you just reverse the process for installing it, right? Just make sure that the high end here is facing you. You can actually put the wires in. the hook there at the same time. Through the hook there. Just push it up and put the lever back down. There you go. And your hot end is installed. And now you just plug it back in. And then the cover just clips back in like that. 